All right, we're back for episode two of Pack Facts, and we're going to be opening one of nearly every magic pack, one block at a time. Before we get started, I just wanted to quickly show you a timeline that I made for the series. That was episode one. You can check out the link in the description if you'd like. Here we are now, day two, episode two, and uh, yeah, I'm excited. Can't wait. We'll be opening these six packs on this episode. Coming up next, and I do have these packs already. We got Tempest Block with Portal Second Age. Episode four, very expensive block, I won't lie. Uh, it's going to be all the Urza sets, and then sixth edition and P3K. And then next we're going to have episode five, which is going to be the Mercadian Mask Block. Nemesis and Prophecy. We're going to open a Rishadan port. It's going to be amazing. All right, for our first pack, it's going to be Homelands. And just bear with me. I promise it'll be worth it. Uh, best card in the set is $3. So, all right, let's crack right into it. I've got my 1,000 degree knife here. And, uh, nah, I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> I didn't clickbait you, you know. This isn't that type of channel. But yeah, here we go. First car looks like an Abbey Matron. The matron still say Sarah's coming back. I doubt she ever existed. Labyrinth Minotaur. Willow Fairy, showing some thigh. Swift as the wind and harder to catch. That's the fairies for you. Some singer bats hanging out. Anaba Bodyguard. Not someone you pick to fight with unless you're fond of pain. We got Samite Alchemist. And a Didgeridoo. Sweet! Wow, one of the five cards that are worth more than a dollar in the set. Probably the only five cards worth in anything. <laughs> I actually play the didgeridoo. Check it out. Time for Mirage. Either read this really fast or pause if you want to read that. And let's check out some prices on Dawn Glare very quickly. All right, so here's the TCG mid on Mirage uh, set. And of course, we have LED topping it off at 130 TCG mid. Um, Next, we have Phyrexian Dreadnought. One for a 12-12. I wonder what Desolator would say about that. Uh, and then we've got some Tutors, Shallow Grave, uh, a few more things, Spirit of the Night. So, yeah, I'm excited. Let's do this. Pack feels nice and tight. Untampered, if you will. Get in there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Civic Guild Mage. To condemn the innocent, you must first condemn yourself. Cadaverous Knight. Village Elder. He had gauges before they were cool. There's some kind of dust on these cards, though, I'm noticing. Kind of weirded out by that, guys. I won't lie. Disempower, Dirtwater Wraith, Seedling Charm. I just want to get to the rare now. Reality Ripple. See that dust? What is that? Has this pack been, like, messed with? There's no way. It was so tight, like... 
wall of resistance. Breath Stealer. Ekundu Cyclops. Thirst. <gasps> oh my god. No way. No way. A freaking Phyrexian Dreadnought. Oh man, what would Desolator say? It looks like it's in good condition. A little miscut on the top, but I actually like that. Oh my gosh. There's our uncommons. Wow, I'm like in shock right now. <laughs> I have to be one of the luckiest pack openers, like, my one cold, well, I don't want to spoil it, but the last block had a really bomb open, too. I mean, yeah, it's not a Lion's Eye Diamond, but that's the second most valuable card in the set, and Jim Mint condition, pretty much. All right, moving on to Visions, though. Nice little wrapper, nice shiny golden wrapper. And let's see, if you want to read the back. Ooh. There we go. Either speed read or pause. All right, let's check out some prices. So here we are with Visions uh, TCG Mid, and we've got Vampiric Tutor, Natural Order, Anvil of Bowgarden, City of Solitude, Undiscovered Paradise, um, some more tutors I think over here maybe, uh, no, just the one tutor, okay, all the rest were in Mirage, um, Summer Bloom, Goblin Recruiter, some cool cards, iconic stuff in here, so let's check it out. Definitely passes the seal test. Alright, let's do this little trick. Put the rare to the back. Desolation! <laughs> oh man. It says, kill a creature, destroy the net deck. Kill the land, destroy the future of net decks. Huh. Desolation. Magma mine. Boom is the flavor text. Just just boom goes the dynamite. That's it. Pretty awesome artwork. Could tell it was Ron Spencer right off the bat. Oh man, I love this artwork. Please do more stuff like this, Wizards. It's it looks like uh the guy that drew Dragon Ball Z, like I don't know, it looks Awesome. Wait a second. I'm, I think this might be the rare. Zalfarin Crusader. Sisei's Ring. Captain of the Weatherlight. Talrum Piper. Juju Bubble. Miraculous Recovery. Tempest Drake, awesome artwork by Jerry Grace. Another Desolation. Army Ants, pretty sweet detailed artwork. Peace Talks. Gonna draw the line in the sand. Ovenomancer. Oh, sorry. If you look on the border here, this paint swirl is the same paint swirl that the artist used, like, for the back of the card. Like, that's actual paint that he splattered down and then they scanned it, believe it or not. I saw an interview with the guy that did it. Another Juju Bubble. Wind shear. All right, I will say that pack was a little strange how it had uh, two duplicate cards and the rare was in a weird position. So comment down below. All 
And moving on to fifth edition. Our next core set. We started off the series with fourth edition. We are going to open every core set also. And hopefully by the end of the series, maybe I'll be able to afford the very old packs. <laughs> but there's always open boosters for that stuff. So before I crack this, let's check out some prices. And here's the TCG mid of fifth edition. We've got Sylvan Library, reprinted, reprinted in Eternal Masters. Uh, Mana Vault, Rushland. This was originally from Ice Age. Necropotence, also originally from Ice Age. Uh, all these are too. Birds of Paradise, that's personally my favorite bop art. You know, say what you will. And then we've got some other cool stuff. Just staple items. Ball Lightning, still surprised that's only a $2 card actually. I used to love playing Ball Lightning in my burn deck. Alright, so without further ado, let's crack this pack. Card inspection, looks good. Ray of Command. Unholy Strength. Banging some bones together. Cat Warriors. Clay Statue. Shanadin Dryads. Bird Maiden. Mind Ravel. And Death Speakers. Raise Dead. Sweet. Marsh Viper. Eternal Warrior. And. Not quite a rare yet. Greater Werewolf. Ugly. Shatterstorm. Bury, bury all artifacts. Back in the bury days. Rod of Ruin. And the rare. Personal Incarnation. Not the best card, but you know. There's just something magical about opening up like old cards that are gen mint. <laughs> so, still worth it. Alright, our next pack is going to be Weatherlight. Check out this crazy alien looking being on the front. <laughs> I saw it, dude. Pretty neat stuff. Let me flip this up for you to read. And as always, speed read or pause if you want to check that out. And let's hit the prices. Alright, so for weather light prices, we got Null Rod topping it off, Firestorm, uh, Gemstone Mine, Pendrel Mist, that gets played a little bit, uh, Doomsday, Buried Alive. Alright, so let's crack it, crack into it. And I just wanted to say thanks again to everybody for watching, uh, Every like and comment really does mean a lot. I'm still a new channel. Really loving it, so I'll be here to stay. So just hit that subscribe if you like what you see. So here we have Lanoir Behemoth. Timid Drake. I sneezed and it bolted. Gerard of the Weatherlight. <laughs> Relearn. Hopefully if you're in college, you're not doing too much relearning. Doomsday. All right, so there's our rare. So maybe that other pack wasn't out of order. Talarian Drake. What up, Professor? Kithkin Armor. Pretty sweet art. Lanowar Sentinel. The forest has as many eyes as leaves. Bloodrock Cyclops. He's big and dumb and ready to fight. 
A lot like old Hornhead. <laughs> Fledgling Jin. Zombie Scavengers. Disrupt. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? Benelish Missionary. Vitalize. Briar Shield. Super nostalgic artwork for me for some reason. I guess digging through commons boxes back in the day. And like a boss, we have Sawtooth Ogre. What a beast. And that's it. <coughs> now we're going to be moving on to Portal. Science. Now I do need to say I love the artwork for some reason on the front of the portal packs. I think it, it kind of reminds me of the upcoming like Azatlan kind of Mayan theme. So maybe it was a uh, foreshadowing. I don't know. Sweet gold package. Let's check out some prices real quick. Coming in at the top place we have Sylvan Tutor. Cruel Tutor. The more you pay for the lesson, the better you'll remember it. Natural order again. Devastation, another tutor. A handful of cards worth at least a couple bucks in the set for it being a starter. And I think the other portals get even better, so get stoked. All right, let's open it. We got Hulking Cyclops, Gargantuans. To build the Gargantuans deck, put together 7 mountains, 7 forests, 10 to 11 red cards, and 10 to 11 green cards for a total of 35 cards. Leave all other cards out. About 13 to 14 other cards should be summoned creatures, including big creatures, cards that destroy lands, and cards that get you lands, such as Hill Giant and Untamed Wilds. Interesting. Ooh, sweet mountain. Land is perhaps the most valuable resource in magic. Without it, a player is quickly vanquished. The idea behind this deck is to destroy that resource and then play powerful creatures to deal a death. So they gave you like deck building tips. Huh. Sweet mountain. Sweet forest, John Avon. Stone rain. Fire Snake, Giant Spider, Spined Worm, it has more teeth than it fit in its mouth, yep, Thing from the Deep, I believe that's our rare, Seafarers fear, fear sailing off the world's edge, not so much da as down its gullet. <laughs> Flash fires. Dry grass is tender before the spark. Deep sea serpent. Awesome artwork. Gotta love Scott Fisher. I actually have a signed card from him. Merfolk of the Pearl Trident. Are merfolk humans with fins or are humans merfolk with feet? You tell me. Comment down below. Gorilla Warrior. Mind Rot. Classic. Spotted Griffin. And a Lizard Warrior. <coughs> Alright, so yeah, our rare was the thing from the deep gotta love the didgeridoo still can't believe we got the phyrexian dreadnought and thanks again for watching everybody i really appreciate it uh if you haven't checked out the rest of my videos i actually do have a wide range of content including magic life hacks tips tricks like i said i'm gonna have some more deck techs and the actual like game related stuff coming um 
I'm going to be interviewing my friend that worked for Wizards of the Coast. So post your questions for him down in the comments. And thanks again for watching.